When I'm doing TV and I got 18, God damn it. Can't everybody stop for 10 minutes? I mean, everybody seems that that's the only, everybody can we stick, Jesus Christ. I mean, it's not that much to ask. Is that when everybody has to move when I'm trying to concentrate? Jesus. And these guys thought I was a pain. I mean, it's so rude. I can't believe it. That's it's so goddamn rude. Just why does everyone all of a sudden have to move? I've had two fucking hours to move around. Wait 10 minutes. Jesus. I'm sorry to explode by that, but that's it's like no one's ever worked on TV here before. <laughs> Jesus. Sunken under the kill. What the fuck do they think I'm doing? I, I really, I actually can't believe what I just saw. Not now. It's like no one here has worked on TV before. I hear a dial tone. Oh, and there were seven people, though. I mean, Jesus. We need to use the studio for 15 fucking minutes. Just everybody, you know. What's that? So Blocks. Sometimes you just don't feel like playing. Maybe it was my inner psyche or spirit saying that I just we just don't want to do this today. But I have definite times when I just literally was like a fish out of water with a football suit on, on the sideline, and almost falling asleep. Nothing, the crowd, the coaches, the fact that there was this large black fellow running at me, did not do anything to me. Except when I saw the faces of these other psychotic individuals I worked with and realized that, okay, we're going to do this our way. In Mel Hall, here we are at the beautiful Cypress Creek Marriott in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, and uh, take it away, sponsors. <laughs> you, you got a brain. <laughs> oh man, they got they got they got pretty good food here, huh? All right, they got some pretty good food. Good rolls. <laughs> I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna, if they have a strike in football, I'm gonna be a scab linebacker. A scab linebacker? Yeah. What, what do you got? A little, uh, how much time you got? We got time to eat a couple rolls or something? Yeah. You know what I told Dion? I'm gonna be a walk on. I told Dion, I'm, I'm gonna be a walk on. I'm gonna go to Atlanta Falcons cap and I'm gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> That was about a four, hey, that was about a four, one, eight, one. He made that ten yards. What's your opinion of King's performance? What's my opinion of King's performance? What the fuck you think is my opinion of it? I think it was fucking horseshit. Put that in. I don't fucking opinion of his performance. Jesus Christ, he beat us with three fucking home runs. <laughs> what the fuck do you mean? What is my opinion of his performance? How can you ask me a question like that? What is my opinion of his of, of his performance? Jesus Christ, he hit three home runs. Jesus Christ. I'm fucking pissed off to lose a fucking game. And you ask me my opinion of his performance. Jesus Christ. I mean, that's a tough question to ask me, isn't it? What is my opinion of his performance? Yes, it is. I asked it, and you gave me an answer. Well, I didn't give you a good answer because I'm mad, but I mean... That wasn't a good question. That's a tough question to ask me right now. What is my opinion of this performance? I mean, you want me to tell you what my opinion of this performance is? And you just did. That's right. Jesus Christ. The guy hits three home runs against us. Shit. I mean, I don't want to... I don't mean to get pissed off or anything like that, but, uh, you know, you asked me my opinion... I mean, he put on a hell of a show. He hit three home runs. He drove in, what, seven runs? Eight. Eight runs. So well, what the hell more can you say about it? I didn't mean to get mad or anything like that, but God damn. He asked me my opinion of his, of, of his performance. See you, Joe. Guys, let's go to Kevin, I believe, in New Jersey. Kevin, what's your question for OJ? Kevin, what's your question for OJ? Hi, good show, dude. Um, my kid, my kid Chris was wondering, do you think it was a bigger feat 
to break 2,000 yards in one season or slice two necks in one night? I, I'm, I'm having a little trouble, Kevin, hearing you. Um, I... All right, Alex is listening to us in Ohio. Hey, Alex. Yes. Hey, Alex. Hey, how you doing? Not Juice? bad. <laughs> Juice, can you hear me, Juice? Yes, I can hear you, buddy. Yeah, uh, I was, remember when you played for the 49ers? Yeah. Yeah, did you kill Bill Walsh? Uh, this is Steve. Steve. From, uh, Steve. How you doing? Not too bad, Steve. I, it was reported back during the, the famous uh, chase, you know, that went on in 94. Yes. It was reported on CBS3 here in, uh, near in Philadelphia that uh, by uh, Larry Menti that you were squeezing your helmet. That I was what? Yeah. Hey, how are you doing? Not good. bad, Brett. Hey, OJ, I, you know, I had a question for you. You know, with everything that, that Michael Vick has been going through and being yeah. indicted, I was just wondering if you wanted to meet me on the Jersey Shore to do live. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> you know, you're going to get jokers, know. but that's the great thing. It's Well, it's that's, uh, no, I don't mind. I mean, yeah. you, you know, you, people can say what if, they, if, they, if it's negative or what, as long as they're serious about the question. Mm -hmm. Right there, you play against the Rams in 1959, and yeah. hot. It's 120 degrees on a Coliseum floor. Yeah. And we had six defensive linemen rotated so keep the pressure on the quarterback. Right. Only how the first half I had to play the full first half. I'm 38 years old. The second half I say to Big Daddy Liskin, if you don't come in the game for me, we'll lose a draw. I'm gonna shoot you. That's it. I'm gonna shoot you after the game. So he never did come in. <laughs> I couldn't find a gun. <laughs> Over the floor of the Coliseum, throwing 80-yard passes, and we're chasing them. We say, we catch you, we're going to kill you. And I went to Rams huddle. I said, look, you jerk, one way, play it, nine o'clock out, you can't win. And with that, he looked at me and said, stop that, you big, fat old man. And from my side of the, the field, Odell Bracey, the right defensive end, hollers, that's all, you're in the wrong huddle.